Welcome to today's presentation. In this lesson, we will learn how to calculate the length of an arc. We are going to achieve this by investigating the various properties of a circle in relation to an arc. We are going to use a question to help us go through this. The question goes, a minor arc of a circle subtends an angle of 105 degrees at the center of the circle. If the radius of the circle is 8.4 centimeters, find the length of the major arc given that pi is 22 over 7. This problem should be approached in this manner. Consider a circle and on this circle we consider just a section on the circumference, the part I've marked red. This part is called an arc and it subtends an angle at the center of the circle. So we are given that the circle is of radius 8.4 centimeters and the arc which I've marked in red, this part here, subtends an angle at the center, the angle that I've marked in green, and this angle is 105 degrees. Apart from this arc which I've marked in red, there's also another arc on the opposite side, so the one I've marked in blue. This arc subtends an angle at the center too, and that angle is the one marked in red. This angle here happens to be a reflex angle. So consider angle 105 on this other side, and from the property that states that angle about a point is 360 degrees in total. So if you already have here as 105 degrees, then on this other side, we are going to have 360 minus 105. That should give us 255 degrees. So 255 degrees. With these angles, we'll be able to calculate whichever the arc length that we are asked to calculate. Remember that this one that is marked in blue is quite bigger than the other one and therefore it's called major arc and the other one is called a minor arc. With this information here, how do we calculate the length of an arc? Be it a minor arc or a major arc. We state the formula as follows. Arc length is calculated as theta over 360 times the circumference. So remember circumference is calculated as 2 pi r or pi d, whichever way you approach it. Theta here represents the angle that is subtended right at the center of the circle by that arc. In the question, we are told to find the length of the major arc. So the major arc is the one that I've marked in blue. The major arc subtends 255 degrees at the center. This is what we are going to use. To remember, theta is 255 degrees and the radius of the circle is 8.4 centimeters. Substituting these values in the formula, arc length is given by theta which is 255 over 360 times 2 pi, remember pi is 22 over 7 as we had been given up here, times the radius 8.4 centimeters. From my calculator, I'm able to get 37.4 centimeters. That marks the end of the solution to this problem. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you in the next video.